Lesbian Awareness Day is on the 26th of April this year and I'm absolutely delighted that we are celebrating that at the Golden Jubilee and that we will be encouraging people to understand and recognise the issues and the barriers that, that lesbians face and still face in Scottish society and also making sure that we as an organisation support our lesbian colleagues to feel comfortable about who they are and bringing them whole, their whole selves to work. At NHS Golden Jubilee we have a range of equality network groups and LGBTQI is one of those and it enables colleagues from the different strands of that umbrella to be able to come together in a safe space to discuss whatever issues they feel are important for them both in the wider world but also things that might you know they might want to address in the Jubilee and, and to raise collectively as a group. I still feel different in the environments that I'm in. I am often the only lesbian in the room. And I know that because other people talk about the relationships that they have and their husbands and, or, and, and the men talk about their wives. It's whether it's internalised, whether I'm feeling mildly different because I'm concerned about what they might be thinking. But I'm actually quite a confident person, so that doesn't impact on me that much. But I do recognise there's a little bit of that going on and that I just have to kind of gently nudge into the, you know, talking about my partner and, you know, the importance of my relationship and making, you know, conversation in, in that space, if it's a social space. Um, obviously, if it's a workspace, I do champion diversity issues. And I do sometimes wonder if they're like, there goes Susan again with the diversity issues. But I think it's really important that I continue to do that and I'm glad I have the confidence to, to push into that space. So if we're talking about Lesbian Visibility Day and lesbians looking for support, it would be, uh, if they were working here, their manager would be one source of support. Colleagues would be another source of support. We also have a very vibrant spiritual care service and they could go and speak to one of our chaplains. Uh, and that, that is very much a, an opportunity for them. And also the network would be, would be a source of support. So I think, it's the, I think that's a great thing about the network is it extends the colleague support doesn't it, to other teams and other departments and recognising other people out there. So that's really important. And, you know, if, if people felt they weren't getting su the, the support they needed from all of those sources, our HR department is also very open to people going and seeking advice about where to go, who to speak to, where to get the support that you need. We also have a counselling service um, that people can, can, can use as well as a member of staff. So lots of different ways in which lesbians and other people can actually access support when they need it.